Recently, when I heard the recording, also known as the Chipmunk Song, it reawakened a persistent question for me. Was David Seville a real person? It turns out, David Seville was the stage name of Ross Bagdasarian Sr. Bagdasarian, let's just call him Dave Seville, actually looked like the cartoon version of himself. Here's how Seville made history. At one point, when he only had $200 to his name, Dave spent $190 on a variable speed VM brand tape recorder. Earlier productions, such as Walt Disney's Chippendale cartoons, beginning in 1943, had used a machine that could play back at double speed, resulting in high-pitched voices that were hard to understand. But Seville's machine could fine-tune the speed, resulting in a good balance between high pitch and clarity. Ready for another interesting factoid? Dave did all the chipmunk voices himself. Don't believe me? Just listen to this section of the chipmunk song. First, I'll play it as you remember it. All right, you chipmunks, ready to sing your song? Oh, there we are. Yeah. Let's sing it now. Okay, Simon. Okay. Okay, Theodore. Okay. Okay, Alvin. Alvin. Alvin! Okay! This time, I'll adjust the speed so that the chipmunks sound more like Dave. All right, you chipmunks, ready to sing your song? I'll oh, say we are. Yeah, let's sing it now. Okay, Simon. Okay. Okay, Theodore. Okay. Okay, Alvin. Alvin. Alvin! Okay! Now, here's another piece of related trivia that may come in handy in case you ever appear on Jeopardy. Dave named his chipmunks after Alvin Bennett, Theodore Keep, and Simon Waronker, three executives at his record label. So you may be thinking, why call the chipmunk song a Christmas miracle? After its release, the song sold 4.5 million copies in seven weeks, helping Seville to recoup the cost of a special tape recorder many times over. This is Steve Eastman for Wait Till You Hear This. Discover more stories like this one on our website. Wait till you hear this.com.